And, and when, any, any idea when you'll be back? Um, hopefully by the first game back after the World Cup. Um, I'm actually out here doing rehab, so... Smith will be a good option to have, both on the pitch and off the pitch. Great player, uh, deceptively quick, has goals and creativity to our team. Even though the team is doing well without him, but having him as an option from the bench to deputize for Martinelli sometimes, or to share the load with Martinelli, or play as an eight sometimes, is a fantastic, tremendous option for any manager, let alone us now, as we are still, as we still remain on the summit. It's great news for me. We know he had to uh, take the surgery options after managing his green issues, and him and the club decided to come to a conclusion of trying to find a lasting solution to the to his growing problems he was suffering with. So he tried to do the surgery and it was projected to be out for a long time. will be a good option to have both on the pitch and off the pitch. Great player, uh, deceptively quick, has goals and creativity to our team. Even though the team is doing well without him, but having him as an option from the bench to deputize for Martinelli sometimes or to share the load with Martinelli or at play as an eight sometime is a fantastic, tremendous option for any manager, let alone us now, as we are still as we still remain on the summit. It's great news for me. We know he had to uh, take the surgery options after managing his growing issues, and him and the club decided to come to a conclusion of trying to find a lasting solution to the to his growing problems he was suffering with. So he tried to do the surgery, and it was projected to be out for a long time and come back in January. But Smitro himself has spoken, saying that he's hoping to be back for the West Ham game in December. That will be the post uh, World Cup, which is fantastic for me. And I'm sure a lot of us now and good now are very excited about this news. I am very excited because I think Smitro can add the needed goals, even though we are the second highest scoring team in the Premier League. Imagine we have Smitro. Maybe we'll be tied with Man City or maybe we'll be actually ahead of Man City in terms of goal scoring. So Smitro for me is a fantastic uh, addition. No, I won't say addition. Option to have is a great part of the team. Unfortunately, has been injured and coming back strongly after the surgery. I hope we can actually continue the form he had last season before he started su suffering for the persistent growing injury. So, Smith Rims have, have come out to tell us that he's hoping to be back for the West Ham game. According to the doctors, they told us, and last night they told us that he should be back uh, in January, but coming back uh, a few weeks earlier, you know, it's not bad news, it's good. Hopefully he can make that. So, let me read some of the quotes we got from Smith Rowe. Very, very important We hear from the horse's mouth himself. Mm, yeah. So, according to Smitro, speaking on this season, before we go to the optimism on this injury, uh, is, uh, okay, Smitro on Arsenal season so far, is going really well at the moment. I'm really happy for the team, but sometimes it's annoying when I can I can't feel like I'm involved, which is which is fair. That most people feel that way when the team is doing well, and you can actually contribute, and you wish to contribute. So I understand how uh he'll be feeling heavy-hearted, but it, it, it is what it is. I'm ha happy that he's coming back. So that for me is good news on its own. So let's continue to read uh the other part of the code. I can't be on the pitch with them. It's amazing to see them doing so well. I can't wait to get back. That should be the spirit. Make sure you take your reputation uh, seriously and get back as soon as possible. And hopefully there is no relapse. So on his return, Smithro then continues to say, hopefully by the first game back after the World Cup, I'm actually out here doing rehab. I'm back on the pitch and stuff. So it's progressing well. So you can hear from Hussey Smiles. He's already doing his rehab, he's back on the pitch. He might not be playing or training with the with the team, but I'm sure he's back on the play, pitch, training alone, uh, doing his uh, ball work. That's fantastic. That's fantastic. Guys, let me know. Are you very, very happy regarding the fact that Smitro is coming back earlier than projected? And could ask something in December before we go to transfer with you. For me, that is great. That could help alleviate the load on Martinelli after coming back from the World Cup. For me, that is great, great, great news. I can't wait to have Smith Rowe back. I think he's one of the most underrated players in the Arsenal team and in English friendship because he is not the most flamboyant player. He goes a bit under the radar, but this guy scores goals. This guy is creative. This guy is a good team player. And the fact that he's coming back before January gives uh gives a lot of Arsenal fans a lot of smiles and something to look forward to. It gives us a bit of option. Smitro can actually play on the left, and sometimes then Martinelli can play as a striker. We know 
uh, in, in Ketia is not the strike second striker we're hoping to get. Even though he has shown signs of improvement, we know Martinelli will do a better job, in my opinion, as a second centre half than in Ketia. Because let me know, am I tripping or do you, you just share similar sentiment with me? Do you think, let's look at this, let's run this poll. Who will do a better job as a centre half, Martinelli or in Ketia? Let me know. For me, we can uh, stick Smithrow as a left winger and put Martinelli as, as a centre half sometime and uh, uh, alleviate the load and, and the weight uh, of playing too many games on Jesus sometimes because for me, I'm not saying Nketi cannot do a job, but we've seen consistently that he's so inconsistent in his performances that he's not so rely. Uh, a lot of us cannot rely on him to give us the productivity and the outcomes of goal that we want. So, like I said, I'm happy for Smitro. He's coming back. It's looking like exciting times for Arsenal. Could Arsenal win the league? It's not impossible. It's not impossible. But let's see how it's going to turn out. So if you like this content, make sure you stick a like on the video. Very, very important. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel. Turn the channel on. And I'll see you guys in the next one.